Okay, I'm the Sinking Platypus, and this is Little Inferno. I've been playing this game for a couple, a few hours, as you can see. I've put about five hours into it. I just kind of wanted to show you guys what it's about. It's a really good little game where, plain and simple, you just burn stuff. Uh, it really is that easy. You get a load of stuff that you buy in the game, you have to wait for it to build. You put it in this little fireplace, which is apparently designed for kids, and you just set it on fire and watch it burn. It's a pyromaniac's wet dream. The whole game is just designed to just destroy stuff. That is it, plain and simple. The more stuff you buy, you can burn as much stuff as you want. You buy it at a time, you have to wait for it to load. You do have these tokens up here where I've got 14. They let you speed up your waiting times. So I spend one on each of these, or two for this one, and they're already there and then. Throw them in the fireplace and set them on fire. That is simply it. That's the whole game. The whole game is just burn stuff. There's nothing in intriguing, nothing crazy about it. But it is good fun. There's a, I guess there's a pyromaniac in all of us that just wants to burn everything. Or maybe it's just me. I mean, it's probably just me, I'll be honest. But this game, it, it's a good fun. You pick it up, play it every now and then, you know. It's not a kind of game you're going to sit and play for 10 hours straight. But it is quite good. It's a good laugh, and it looks nice. Uh, you've got I think it's seven catalogs here, seven different catalogs of random stuff to go through and burn. So I figured I'd just show you a few other things and just burn some stuff. Uh, I'm going to buy a miniature sun. I'm going to burn that at the end. Uh, it takes a bit of time to actually get the sun, so I'll buy some other stuff. They're a bit expensive. They're expensive, so take a bit of time, and I don't want to really waste. I haven't got many of the tokens left. So what I'll do as well is I'll buy a couple of other crappy little things that I can burn that won't take as long, I can just throw them in the fireplace. We can sit in now and just watch this fire. Slowly fade out, staring at the fire and burn the spiders. But yeah, I mean, this game is just, it's a good laugh, you know. I've played a lot of games like it that aren't as much fun, you know. This is just, it's not it's not designed to be a big story game. There is kind of a little story. You've had communications with the girl who lives next door and she's burnt her house down. And That sounded really unsympathetic, how little I cared there. But, you know, it's not the kind of story... It's Don't get me wrong, you know, it's not a Call of Duty. It's not the kind of story you're going to be immersed in, you're going to be thinking about, you're going to care about characters, or whatever. It's just kind of going on. All you're caring about is how to set things on fire and what the next thing you're going to set on fire is. It's quite cool watching the stuff disintegrate as well hearing not so much hearing the things scream but you do hear like for some reason some of the food has eyes and it will scream which is a little bit creepy i'll be honest wow that spider just got blowtorch but in fact I'll, I'll pull out some of that food now we'll burn the food you see that this is like the, f the kind of food section uh you've got kind of just normal household stuff uh, totally recalled toys, snooty foodie, first person shoppers who like gamer stuff, stylish living, yeah this is just very pretentious stuff but it's good to burn, shop and all, this is the, I'm using air quotes here, manly section because nothing's more manly than protein and a shaver and yeah whatever. And then you have the existence now, the kind of futuristic last one, which is quite good fun, to be fair. They're all good fun. Let's fa we'll burn anything if we had the option. Let's face it, if you had a fireplace in front of you, you'd want to throw random stuff into it anyway. Alright, so let's have a look. What do we got here? Uh, it's quite nice as well. They've set up the physics so you can throw the stuff around the fireplace to try and put it out and destroy it. The faster you destroy something, the faster you can burn something else, so... Sit him down there, hope he didn't catch fires. Oh, it's getting freaky now. It's getting freaky in the uh, robot house. Heat, heat in it. it's, it's getting heated there now. And now they're on fire. And now they explode and die. Alright, well, I wasn't really sure what I actually wanted to show in this video, which is why I've just burnt some random stuff. Uh, I'm going to burn what's left here. 
And then I'm actually going to stick, there's a vi an in-game video one that's a little bit sick and twisted. I'm going to stick that on as a way to kind of end the video and a way to sum it up, really, because <laughs> it does kind of sum it up. Uh, but first, we'll burn, burn some cigarettes, because why not? They're going to set a toast on fire, which is a little piece of bread. He's really happy, and then he's very scared. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm. <laughs> I know. I said I was just gonna do the sun. I'm gonna burn these random things as well, just because they look quite. It looks good when you've got other stuff burning with the sun. So, you know, who would want to waste the sun? So try and move all these frames out of the way, just so they don't set everything straight on fire. All right, random picture, a bit of corn, block, block, another block. Part of that flame, clock, some more blocks. And burn it all with the power of the sun. Yeah, it's a cheap game. I think I picked it up on Humble Bundle. Didn't pay a lot for it. It's good fun. I've probably put in far more hours than anyone ever really should have put into it. I think there might be definitely some pyromaniac problems going on here. So what I'm going to do is just leave it now. I'm going to end this video with the in-game video that I mentioned earlier. Uh, yeah, check it out, guys. Enjoy. toys yeah. you know what's more fun than playing with toys huh? setting them on fire with your new little inferno entertainment fireplace your chimney way up in the sky it's been snowing for years and we just don't know why our world is getting colder but there's no need for alarm just sit by your fire burn all of your toys and stay warm 